guys thank you for tuning in back to my channel in this video i'll be showing you guys how i created this hairstyle it's a crochet braid i use six packs of expression hair to pre-braid the hair it took me about three hours to pre-braid this hair and i have about 60 strands of braid so it took me like three hours to make the braid and then it took me one hour to crochet the hair into my hair so if you want to see how i achieved this look definitely keep watching please don't forget to give me a thumbs up share and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys so here is the hair i'm using expression color one so i cut the hair into two take out a section of hair depending on how big or tiny you want your hair to look I want um, jumbo braid so I'm taking a chunk of hair so you want to feather the end of the hair because you don't want it looking blunt so you just pull the end And then brush out the hair to make sure there is no lumps and bumps. You want your hair looking very silky and detangled. After that, you want to slide in the hair on your rope. Here I'm using my shoelace. So slide in the hair and then divide the hair into three equal section and then start braiding so by the time you take down this hair from the um, rope you automatically have a loop where you will um, crochet the hair onto your hair As you can see I'm doing a very loose braid so it's up to you if you're going for um, loose braid look or you want your braids to be tighter one more time slide in the hair on the rope whatever rope you're using section the hair into three equal section and start braiding
after braiding the hair you want to go in with scissors and trim off any flyaways this is going to give you a very smooth look When you're set when you're satisfied with the lick then you want to um, put the end of the braid into hot water to make sure that the ends are sealed and your braid is not going anywhere. You can go ahead and use towel to dry excess water on the hair. I've already started um, installing the hair. I almost forgot to show you my brick pattern, so I just thought I should show you guys. So I have 12 braids in front, like this, like zigzag braids going across like this. So I will go ahead and install the back side and then I will come and show you guys how I'm doing it. It's obviously a um, normal crochet uh, method that I'm using. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey guys so I'm um, nearly done I've been doing the more crochet bridge so there is nothing serious about it I'll just quickly show you guys um, how I'm installing the hair so you just need to slide in the crochet needle into your hair like so make sure that your lash hook is open slide in the hair into the lash hook like so close the lash hook and pull the hair through open your lash hook slide in the end of the hair into the lash hook close the lash hook and pull it through like so Take out the lash hook and then secure the hair. Slide in the needle into your braid like so. Make sure the lash hook is open. Slide in the hair into the hook. the lash hook and pull the hair through slide in the end of the braid like so and pull it through the loop and then secure the hair
that is it guys this is the finished look don't forget to give me a thumbs up share and subscribe to my channel bye guys see you in my next one